Hey, 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 welcome if you are new here or welcome back if you have been here before. I am Freya, this is Budgie Budgets and today is savings game day um, and we have a little bit extra. We have $90 to play with. So we've got 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80 and 90. So let's see, actually let's put these all back one. And we'll get our binder out and we'll actually be organized this week and remember to get some budgie bucks happening. All right, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. And we'll put ten dollars in here. All right, let's get this, you guys. So, first of all, Winter Dreams is over. It's finished, you guys. Woohoo! And I mean, we can tell because I can't stop sneezing. So we know spring is coming. So 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, and 100 in that one. I will pop that off to the side for now and let's get out. Uh, let's get out spring. I had to really think then about what uh, season we're going into. <laughs> oh dear. I'm bulk filming today, you guys. So I am a little bit, um, so we will get a start on that one, uh, probably next week or if not the week after, um, because it's not quite spring yet. We're still, we're still in August. Okay. So we owe never have I ever a dollar. So let's deal with that. We'll pop that here. And then let's play. So um, someone said to me what I should do is do this. <laughs> so then I know which dice is for the top and which dice is for the bottom. And you, my lovely, are a genius. <laughs> Look at that. So, so clever because now I'll know. Because every week I say which one's which and then I immediately forget. Because ADHD. You can hear my latest ADHD purpose squawking in the background like an absolute menace. That was impulsive and poorly thought through. <laughs> Not really. I mean, we wanted her for a long time. I just didn't quite realize the impact. Uh, like I, well, I did, but also I didn't. Anyway, let's get this. Okay, so three and five. Have we done that? No. Overslept for work. Um, no. I'm like fastidious about being on time to places so much so that I'm normally there like stupidly early because I'm so worried about being late. Um, so yeah, no. Uh, two and two have done that. Six and three. Skipped a class. We did that last week, but did I not cross it off? I mustn't have. Okay, let's go again, because we definitely did that last week. And the answer is yes. Yes, I have. One, two, three, four, five. We've done that. Two. Oh no. Uh five and one. Almost drowned. <gasps> yes. Yes, I have actually twice and it is why I as a person am incredibly claustrophobic. So when I was young, I think I would have been about six, I fell into a lake. There was like a like a mini pier, like a yeah, like a mini pier kind of thing. Not even a pier, it was just like a platform that sat above this just disgusting old like like man-made lake. Um and it had it was full of reeds and I fell in and then I couldn't get back out because the platform was so much higher than the lake was, I couldn't reach. And my legs got caught up in the reeds. Horrifying. It was actually my uncle that pulled me out. And um, to this day, he says he has never seen anyone run faster than my mum when she realised um, that I had fallen in, except obviously for him because he got to me first. So that was the first time. The second time I almost drowned, I was about... 12 or 13 and I was going kneeboarding um, and I had never been kneeboarding before and I didn't want to do kneeboarding but it was kind of pushed on me 
and I was behind the boat of somebody and they had crossed. So it was me and a friend and they had crossed the lines. And so when he took off, one kneeboard flipped over the other and I wound up under the water upside down with a kneeboard and no one had told me how to get the strap off, which in hindsight just seems like the most ridiculous thing ever. Like surely if you're gonna strap a kid to a kneeboard, the first thing you tell them is that you rip the strap if you wind up under the water. And it was some uh, very attractive 20 odd year old guy. And at the time that seemed like such a big deal because I was little, like I was 12 or so. I might've even been younger than that. Um, and he like, dived in and ripped the strap for me and pulled me out so there you go funnily enough I did then I'm an excellent swimmer and I did then go on um through my uni days to be a lifeguard and have saved several people myself um so I don't have a fear of drowning anymore but those instances did lead to me being I'm like I'm really claustrophobic um and I think that I think that it's because of that so there you go what an interesting story time okay we'll do one more Oh, Ava slept for work. Didn't we just do that before? We did. Still no. <laughs> Still no, Carly. Okay. Um, this one's from Prince by Carly Studio. One, two, three, and four dollars going in there today. We will take out that four or oh, one and put in a five. Uh so ugh, nearly just dropped them all. This now has 10, 25, 26. So this is just a little one because it's just fun. Um yeah there you go okay full house uh should i do this first or should i do this last let's do it now and we'll we'll see we'll see what the damage is and maybe we'll come back to it let's have a look um because i was also considering putting 25 dollars into roll it up but that feels silly when i still have to finish Karalama too. Okay. Oh, there's, there's just not many at all left to go. Um, full house is one from my store guys. So are the seasonal challenges. If you're interested, um, I always forget to say where my, the challenges are from and then people wind up asking me in the comments. Okay. So six, we'll do another one and a 10, of course, of course. Okay. So 16, we'll, we'll, we'll do that for now. And then let's see, let's, see so six of spades that's nearly all the spades done i'm so excited i can't wait until this is finished it's gonna be such a big reallocation and queen of hearts we love the queen of hearts off with her head <laughs> um it's book week this week um for my youngest obviously the older kids don't do book week anymore uh so that's got 10 15 and 16 in there um so my little one it's so cute she was going to go as hermione because the it's like witchcraft and wizardry is their theme this year at their school um but then her little friend her little bestie um who i think it's safe to say has a little crush on her wants to go as harry potter and amy's dying for her to go as Ginny. <laughs> I'm like, that's so cute. However, my daughter has really buffy curly hair, so she is much more suited to Hermione, but that's cool. I think she's going to go to Ginny. She wants me to straighten her hair and everything. Uh, so 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 71, 72, 73, 273 in that one now. That is a chunky boy. I really struggle with these larger challenges, um, if I'm being honest. I like my little quick wins. Uh, so we're putting 20 into Cara Lama and then we will see how we go. And if we can come back and do more, we will come back and do more because I need this to be finished by the end of the month so that we can put it towards our car insurance bill. Okay. So Cara Lama now has... Uh, 100, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 210. So it's just $40 left to go. We're getting close. We are getting close. Thank God I started that when I did. Okay, and then this one is for our... Oh, that's not the dice we need, is it? No, it's this one. Is this the 10? Yeah. Okay, this one is for... What have I got money over here for? What's that from? Oh, that's from the completed challenge. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh dear. Five minutes goes by you guys and I've got no clue what's going on. 
Okay, so two pins. This one is from Amanda and Mum Wife Budget Life. It's so cute. It's so, so cute. Um, I love it. So you roll a 10-sided dice. And then I think, yeah, you can roll it twice if you want to try and play for a spare. I decided not to, although now I'm thinking maybe I should have... Um, so this now has 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 in it. We might come back and do another one. We'll see how we go because I want to add a fair bit to roll it up. Um, so we'll pop that over there. <sighs> I don't know what to do about this challenge, you guys. It's just, these challenges are just not for me. Uh, 20, 40, 50, there's 55 in there. I think... I'm really reluctant to move it on. I love it, guys. It's a beautiful challenge. It's by Flo and Ali, and it's a beautiful, beautiful challenge. It's just not, it doesn't give me the dopamine that I need. I thought it would. I thought it would because it's stickers. But the whole adding the same amount every week um, is, I'll leave it there for now. But I think, yeah, no, I think I have to, it just doesn't, it just doesn't, it's not, it's not enough dopamine. It's too much like regular cash stuffing. Um in which case I may as well just put a category for it in there and call it a day kind of thing. All right, let's do Save the Rainbow. Uh-oh, this is another one from my store. Come on, there it is. Okay, so green is three. Um, should we do two in here? One, two, three. Uh, let's do it. And a red. Oh, of course. <laughs> of course we got the big one. Oh dear. Okay. One, two, three, four, and five. Let's do that. You guys, I think I'm just mulling it over in my brain. So this has got 10, 15, 20, 21. This one will eventually save a hundred. I think I'm going to get rid of that challenge. I think I'm going to, I am, I am, I am, I am, I am. Ugh, I'm going to move it along. I know that some people would think that's naughty, uh, but I don't care because it's my channel. I can do what I like. <laughs> kidding, you guys. I'm kidding. I love you. Um, I love you very, very much. Um, but no, in all seriousness, um, you have to do what works for you. And if it's not working, like if I only had a few on it left, but I'm not even halfway. Uh, so 10, 20, 35 and 40. This is happening. This is happening. Because <laughs> that's where I need it. This is where I need it to be. So let's get it done. All right. So Cara Lama is now finished with 120, 40, 60, 80, 210, 20, 30, 40, and 50. This is an awesome challenge. This is from Jen at Budgets and Dreams. It's I got it as a collection. You would have seen as I went through before that I've got a few different ones in there. Um, a different, few different llama related goods. Um, so cute and so awesome because now I have $250. Um, so I will pop this here and I will pop this other challenge here because otherwise I'm going to forget about it because, you know, we all know what I'm like. Okay, there we go. Now we have an extra $15 Woohoo! to work with. That's fun, isn't it? Best we get some new challenges in here. Hey, um, so I think... Um, I don't know whether to do not my gun drop buttons as a, uh, I think we'll just, I think we'll put in Twister for now. What else have I got challenge wise? I'm trying to think. Let's put Twister in there. This is a new one in my store. Twister and it's pick your own, uh, amounts. What else have we got in here? Uh, Okay. Let's do that for now. And I've got another challenge in mind for the other empty slot that I've got. But I haven't got it. I don't think I have it in here and printed. Hang on, guys. Oh, no, I do. I do, I do. I do. No, I have another, another challenge in mind. <laughs> you guys, this is my little bag of goodies. How terrible is this? So bad. Okay, let's do this one. Let's do this one from Prince by Carly Studio. Okay, are we going to have to cheer some amounts? Oh, my goodness. You guys have got stuff everywhere now. What am I doing? Uh, so one, two, three, four, five of those, 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 one, two, three, four, five. I said there's five of everything. I should have been able to work that out because it's five by five. Oh, Freya, you are a special kind of possum sometimes, aren't you? Uh, let's just do one, two, three, four, and five. 
let's keep it simple still bid um yeah let's do that so that one will go in here and then i think maybe we'll do the same thing with twister i think we'll just do Oh, should we do two, four, six, eight and make it a bit, yeah, let's do that. Two, four. Oh no, hang on, I've not thought that out. <laughs> two, four, six, eight. <laughs> oh, you guys, you guys, you guys. Let's do two, four, three, six, um, seven and eight. I don't know why. Don't ask. Don't ask. We all know I'm a special case, okay? <laughs> We all know it. I do also want to bring back Shut the Box and Save Opoly. Um, I am going to wait until that Full House Challenge is gone, skis, because that is a beast. Um, okay, so roll it up. How much have we got here? 20, 25. Okay, let's roll and see what we get. And then, oh, this is the dice that came with my roll it up. And it's like the prettiest color dice. I've, no, I've not seen that in any of the... Oh my goodness, one to buy. This is being cheeky for me today. Oh, five, perfect. Okay, we're going to put five in there. Um, so that's that. And then... <laughs> you know what, guys? We're going to be cheeky. Um, because we're reallocating from that other challenge, we're going to put in the two as well. So we've got the five and then another two. And then we're actually going to do an extra sneaky 25. Um... I don't know what we're going to use this for yet. Okay, that's what we're doing. Um, just to give this a little, a little boosty boost. Um, my girls are dead keen for me to use this for a bunk bed for them. Uh, but they're impatient, you know? Uh, so one, two, three, four, and five. So we'll change that over. Awesome. So this now has 20, 40, 50, 60, 75 in there. Nice. Um, this is the, whoops, this is the roll it up challenge is also from the lovely Jen at Budgets and Dreams. It's so cute. So you just roll all the way through. So you do all of those ones and that saves you 25 and then you go back and do the next 25 and so on. And then once you've done all of those, you can cross off 100 and then you start start again until you get through to cross off 500 and then you get through to $1,000 which is just such a cool, cool way to save a thousand bucks. So let's see what we've got. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 10, 11. Okay, so let's start. Let's do one for Twister because why not? Oops, sorry, budgie. Goodness. Sorry, you guys, this feels like it's gonna be a long video now. Um, okay, so Pepple. And purple is three. Three. And we'll leave that there because we won't have enough if we roll an eight. And then have I got five left still? Yes, definitely. Definitely, lady. What are you talking about? Uh, okay, so we need two dice. Oh, no. Guys, we don't have the same problem. <laughs> I'm going to forget. Okay, green for the top, purple for the side. We'll do it the same. Same Z's. Okay, so four and two is a moon. So we'll put two in there, beautiful. Just little starts, little starts. And then let's do another save the rainbow. Since we now don't have that many, oh, wrong dice. I did that last week too. Um, oh, I got, that's so funny. It was a two either way. There you go. Okay, so that now has in it 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23. Brilliant. Okay, and then what have we got left? One, two, three, four. Ooh, we could do that one, but we're risking an IOU if we get a five. I suppose we're risking IOU anywhere, aren't we? Let's do one more Never Have I Ever, cause funny. Unless you guys are sick of hearing about my story. Also possible, uh, two and five, one, two, three, four, five. Got fired from a job. Uh, no, no, I've never been fired. I've left plenty of jobs, but I've never been fired. Uh, we'll do another one more. Uh, six and 
four, one, two, three, four. Regifted a gift. Um, I don't know. I'm sure I have. I'm sure I have at some point. So we're going to say yes. Um, I'll leave it there and then I'm going to put, just because I don't want an IOU. So 10, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29 in that one now. Um, yeah, re-gifted a gift. I mean, I'm, yeah, I'm sure I have. Probably like more so from my kids, like not so much something that's been given to me, but something that's been given to my kids that like they already have or, um, yeah. Okay, we'll do a one in here. And then you guys, we are all done. Wackadoo. That is, all, what am I doing? That is awesome. Okay, we'll put this, that's, is that the right one? That's not the right one. That's the bowling one. Oh, Freya. Get it together, love. Okay. All right, you guys, that is all of our savings challenges done, which is awesome. And so we are going to reallocate. So winter challenge. <sighs> it pains me to do this. However, what I am going to do is put that 100 in here. So this is fully funded now at $500. So 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. That mojo, I mean, technically it forms part of our... Um, it forms part of our emergency fund, basically. Um, I'm not, am I going to color those in? I'm not going to color them in. I can't be bothered. I'll clean it off. We'll put a fully funded placeholder in there. We'll know that's $500 in there. So that works as our, for anyone who's new, isn't sure. Mojo is like my, yes, Mojo money. That's our account buffer. It works as our kind of credit limit. So if we're spending on things that we have money for in the envelopes, we spend it out of that money and then replenish it the next time we cash on stuff if we're not pulling the money directly from the envelopes, which we very rarely do. So um, that's what that is for. So that is that one. And then it's the big mama's turn because this, I'm not gonna bother coloring this in. Absolutely not, absolutely not, you guys. Um, this baby is going to be nice and chunky now. Awesome. Okay, so in car insurance now, we have 200, 300, 400, 20, 40, 60, 80, 500, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 610, 20, 30, 40. 640, which places us well over halfway and is ready for a nice big chunk of cash to come from our next pay, which will, oh, that is going to stretch that envelope. Look at that chunky boy. Awesome. That's so good, you guys. That is a weight off my mind that that challenge is done and in there. And it means we, I definitely know we're going to have enough money to pay that annual bill. We'll be able to cash flow in the month. It does mean our binders probably won't grow this month as much as, um, you know, they have in previous months, but it is what it is. The bill's covered, it's covered, it's paid for in cash. And we're paid for the year, and then we don't have to worry about it. So, um, yeah. Okay, you guys, that is all for today. Uh, we didn't make as big a dent in Full House as I might have liked, but that's okay because we started some other fun new challenges in there too. So it is what it is. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys have a beautiful weekend. I hope the sun has been shining all week. Um, it's beautiful here today, and I'm fingers crossed that keeps on going because spring is coming, you guys. Um, so I will see you again on Sunday for my weekly budget with me. Woo -woo. Uh, and it should be a, it'll be a supersized one, hopefully, because it'll be a, like my husband's pay and a child's a monthly child support payment. So it'll be a chunky one. So, uh, yeah, join me then if you're interested. Don't forget to like, comment, and please subscribe. Um, I love you guys. I love my subscribers. This has been the most exciting journey, I think, ever. Like, it's just put me so far out of my comfort zone, and it's just so, so nice to hear from you guys and interact with you guys. It is awesome. So, um, yeah, I will let you go, but have an awesome weekend, you guys. Okay, love you. Bye-bye.